And you're like, did you just wipe the counter down with that rag that you're wiping on my damn food? Did you just wipe your hands with that? Did you just wipe the walls <laughs> with that same rag? You're so gross, I don't want it. Is that, you don't see it? That don't look like giraffe. Look at it, close your eyes. Like <laughs> I'm disappointed in the size. That's what she said. <laughs> Da -dun -dun. Hello you guys and welcome back to another Vivian Tries. On this Vivian Tries, you guys did it again. You voted for weird Walmart things on my Instagram. Hop on over there and follow me so that you have the opportunity to vote for the next one. Number one, wine bottle glass bottle. I'm excited. I want to see if an entire bottle. Do you really think an entire bottle of wine is going to fit in here? We can sip on it all night. Everybody gets their own. Right there it says holds 34 ounces of your favorite drink. I want a whole wine bottle to fit in here. That's why I bought you. No ma'am. That's only like two cups. I don't want to be pouring some later. I do love it though. Let me go rinse this out and then we'll get the party started. I'm not gonna lie. I'm disappointed in the size. That's what she said. <laughs> da -dun -dun. I'm gonna take a Vivian head off for that. You can't hype me up and then let me down once you show me the goods. <laughs> Brand new bottle. I just opened it five seconds ago. We're gonna pour it all the way to the rim. So are you guys ready? Here we go. Are y'all excited? I feel like people that don't know me are gonna think that I have a drinking problem, which I don't even drink. <laughs> oh wait. I take it back, you're getting that bonus Vivian head. <laughs> Fun fact, these are 34 ounces. And baby, how much of this can I drink? <laughs> That's not a challenge, but watch it during the video. Sometimes I jump around between products in the video, so sometimes it'll go up, sometimes it'll go down. Let me try it, ready? The thing is, if you don't finish it, then what? I gotta get a funnel and pour that shit back in here? See, now you challenge me. I gotta finish it. I am not about to pour all this back in there. Girl, nobody has time for that. And this is cheap wine from town. <laughs> so we gotta drink it now. We ain't wasting. Girl, we don't waste nothing. Don't worry, I can finish it. Oh my God. I'm not gonna drink for three months now. How cute is my hoodie? It's cute. It'll be on my website, cute.com, right after this video. These in five different colors drop today. Number two, treat pops. For the birthday party, for the catering company, for school, last minute. Oh my God, we gotta bring a baked good. I'm gonna show you a hack today. Parent of the year, for sure. Reminded me of the ice cream. You know those ice creams that you push through? I think they're called push pops too. But this is for cupcakes. I'm sure you can use them for ice cream too. Dude, how many kids are in a classroom now? Like 30, 20? All you have to do for this Vivian hack is buy you some of these at Wally World. Oh, Dollar Tree. Y'all can totally do this. Call me. We're gonna coordinate how you're gonna roll this out. Dollar Tree, y'all need to get on this. This is easy peasy, y'all can do this. Here's the hack. Buy these little miniature cupcakes and you're gonna cut them in half. Then you got the lid, boom. And I'm even saying get fancy, put a little Vivian head sticker on there, boom. You're good, you're gonna win. And I brought some extra candy from Halloween. These were 90% off and I bought tons of them because I need them. You understand the supplies you need. If you get different colors, then you can layer it and look real Instagrammy. Are you supposed to wash these? Does it have fungalitis in there? I don't think so. You're supposed to eat that. I don't think you're supposed to wash that. I'm not gonna wash it. This is gonna take you 10 minutes to make. Easy peasy. I'm gonna do one without cutting it because at first I thought we should cut it, right? But no girl, no work. <gasps> I'm so fucking you just take that off. How cute is that alone? Now you just drop it in there, right? Boom. See, two cupcakes. And you do them different colors so you look like Pinteresty. Everybody's gonna be so impressed with your damn baking skills. They don't know you need to do nothing. Had some wine in your giant wine bottle glass. Hybrid. <laughs> so here's a purple one. Just drop it in gently. I don't wanna squish it, so I'm gonna push it like this. Look at that. Better than that picture right there. And then you put the little lid on top. <gasps> Do you love it? <laughs> then what I was thinking was cutting them in half. That way you can get multiple layers of frosting on there. Cause if you're like me, you love the frosting part. Well, there's number one. Girl, we could sell these. Okay, here's the business plan. You guys ready? Grab a pen at church. Sunday, tell them you had a bake sale and you're raising funds for <laughs> your bake. <laughs> for your 
freaking vacation. Yeah, not for nothing else. You wanna go on vacation. This was my first thought was to cut them like this in half. And then you have this little extra one. This one. Now don't throw these away. That's a good snack for later. <laughs> uh uh, cause you're gonna stuff it. Just follow along. Girl, your shit's gonna be so good. They're gonna ask you to bake for every, see, you might not wanna do this. <laughs> then they're gonna put that on you to be the classroom bake mom because they're so impressed with your damn skills and you're like, girl, no. I don't even wanna be up here. Why are you calling me? <laughs> Let's assemble. Take this little thing out of here because you can just put it through later. You want to be able to control the tower. So let's start with pink. You see what I'm saying? Look. Oh yeah. And then you push it down real good like this. Remember this one. See, it just looks prettier. Oh, but your hands are dirty. I'm sure you can just wipe these down later. Okay. Oh, <laughs> a three second rule. There's a three second rule. There's no fungalitis on my desk. Save this one for your husband. He doesn't care. He'll eat anything. <laughs> <laughs> he will. Shit, he's got a 20 second rule. Not even a five. Ooh, wait a second. I squished it down too much, I think. My first idea was so good and I done messed it up. This looks artisanal. <laughs> Dang. And then top it off with these. Oh no, this one's ruined. You're gonna be able to sell that one for full price. This is going in the clearance aisle. They're gonna know. You drop this one <laughs> a couple times. It's like a milkshake. <laughs> it's all <laughs> together. Lid on, get a little wet wipe. Like they do at <laughs> fast food restaurants where they wipe everything down with the same fucking rag. And you're like, did you just wipe the counter down with that rag that you're wiping on my damn food? Did you just wipe your hands with that? Did you just wipe the walls <laughs> with that same rag? You're so gross, I don't want it. Look how cute this is. This is even for like on the go. You need a snack. <laughs> Portion control, you know you have two little baby men and cupcakes. I wanna stuff some candy in there. Put a cupcake, then a candy then a cupcake. Everybody loves the prize in the middle. These mini cupcakes are so perfect. Put it right there. This took a whole 10 minutes to do. If you got 20 kids, you need 30 minutes. Boom, you're done. Pro tip, get your knife, push it down. That way you don't get your fingers all in there. This is still the, my favorite. It's beautiful. Just aesthetically, visually, this one's the best. <gasps> Reusable. You better wash these out and use them again. Don't throw this away. Whoever is taking these to their classroom, they need to collect them from all the kids, put them through some hot soapy water, and then put some ice cream in there, freeze them, and then. <laughs> what the fuck was that? So I'm gonna give the treat poppers five Vivian heads. Number three. Oh, that made too much noise. Everybody's gonna know you're taking a sip again. <laughs> oh, it got on my shirt. This is a new release on cute.com. So we're gonna take product pictures. <laughs> Things triple in after the fact. No, uh-uh. Find your balls. <laughs> you know what they're for. When you have these types of bottles, who the hell is gonna clean the bottom of this? How are you gonna clean all this from this bottle? Look at that. What about this one? This is gross, see? Who's gonna get all the way in there to scrub that? Nobody. Here's the solution. These are little balls that you put in here and then you swish it around, <laughs> cleans it. You think it's gonna work? I'm gonna say no, but it might work. It is a small scrubbing silicone bristled stainless steel core forces it to scrub against the surface that way, like me. You don't have to go to Dollar Tree and get one of those baby brushes to clean baby bottles. No, you don't need that. People are gonna be like, uh, you got babies? No, that's to clean these stupid ass bottles. And you look inside when you go to use them and guess what? There's all kinds of gunk fungalitis down here growing. You're in your own laboratory at home. How cute. Look at them. Do you put these in the dishwasher or something or just like soapy water and then you're gonna lose these. Somebody's gonna throw this shit away. Let's try this one first. This is whipped cream. First things first, I'm the realist. <laughs> A little bit of water, loosen up some stuff. Drop your balls in. Let me show you what's inside. It does have like this little ball inside. Can I pop it out? Stainless steel marble in there. <gasps> My question is, does that not get funky in there? In that little bitty opening where the ball is? So easy, I just pop that right back in there. For camping, one. And don't be gross and just add water. That's not enough to clean your stuff. Put a little bit of soap, a little bit of detergent or something in there. Oh, doomsday. We gotta do a doomsday video. If this video gets 10,000 likes, we'll do another doomsday gadget product video. You're gonna shake it. Okay, we're still kind of dirty. I'm gonna try to dump out some water to see if that helps. Maybe the water was too much and it couldn't get to the surfaces. 
I mean, if I gotta shake that hard, I might as well just put it through the dishwasher. Here's a pro tip. Put a little bit of hot water in there overnight. The next day, put it through the dishwasher. And I put this one in the video because sometimes you don't have a lid. So how are we gonna shake it? Let me go rinse this out so that we can see the streaks because I can see them clearly. I'm a little impressed. I kinda liked it, but I'm, I'm not gonna say I recommend it. Drop them in, put a little bit of water. Okay, let's see. I think it helps, but I don't think it scrubs. Rub and scrub are totally different. For very lightweight kind of jobs, fine, buy you some. For the heavy duty stuff, the shit that's been crusty for like three days in your sink, because you don't feel like washing dishes, I don't think so. So I'm gonna give the sponge balls two. Vivian had, sorry about it. I don't hate them though. Number four. These are color changing tumblers and straws. These are brand new at Wally World and I think I love them. It says ice iced baby. That's why I picked these up. And not just for your normal like soda pop or fresh squeezed orange juice, iced coffee. Do we need this? Probably not. All your friends get their own color. So you know that's your drink, not mine. Don't be putting your nasty ass mouth on my drink. Who knows where that mouth has been or who it's been on? You know what I'm saying? Like, don't be sharing drinks. That's gross. Oh, that's a leopard print. Cute.com. I'm bringing in some leopard print. Oh, you guys voted on my Instagram. And then here are your straws. Color coordinated. I need to say this because these videos are not sponsored. Walmart needs to go ahead and throw uh, Vivian tries some coins because I've been working this pole for a long time <laughs> and y'all ain't even dropped a couple dollars for me. You know why? She be telling you don't buy this at Wally World and she calls it Wally World. You probably don't like that. Is it tacky if we put like ice and wine? Is that tacky? Is that she's low class kind of tacky? I don't know the rules to the drinking game. Jamaican Me Happy, that stuff is so good. Y'all don't gotta sponsor me. I'm gonna recommend that every day. Okay, let's see. Look at it. Oh, that one's turning purple. How cool is this? This one? This one's turning green. Oh, this one's turning like a reddish color. Okay, let's pour some orange juice in all of them. Should I put some wine? Let's try it for fun. What do you think that's gonna happen? I was gonna say these are kind of basic and silly, but I don't know, I love them. A little bit here. Oh, let's put some water on the last one. Are you impressed or am I the only one impressed? And the longer it sits, the more color pigmented it gets. Now they had these for cold drinks and hot drinks. I got the cold drink one, but they do have like for coffee and hot drinks. Get you those if you want some hot drinks. These three are my favorite right here. This one, not so much. The green and the orange kind of blend together. So I'm gonna give the color changing tumblers five Vivian heads. Number five, Magic Snake. Is this not like a toy when we were growing up? Do you remember we made an elephant, not an elephant, but like a giraffe? Do you remember? You remember? <laughs> Tell me what comedian says it. You remember? <laughs> oh my God, it's a magic snake. <laughs> you see, this is how you make a lizard, a snake. You can make a frog, a giraffe, a teapot, a heart. A flower, girl, all kinds of things. You'll be here for hours and hours. No, I'm kind of losing my nostalgia. It's kind of flying away because now, no, there it is. There it is, the giraffe. Is that, you don't see it? That don't look like giraffe. Look at it. Close your eyes. Like <laughs> That's a snake. It's a cobra. <laughs> you don't know what a damn cobra looks like. That looks like a cobra right there. Look, use your imagination <laughs> right there. Cobra. I don't know why I bought this, but I did. It's not bad, it's way overpriced though. Look at this. Again, the same rattlesnake. So I'm gonna give the, I just bought it for the childhood memories toy. Pass it on to the kids. Let's keep this one alive. Number six. Look at this wackadoodle thing. There's a lot of problem with kids getting into medicine cabinets. I don't have that problem. I don't got any little kids running around the house, but I do have a problem getting into the pantry and having snacks. Can we lock up some snacks? Isn't that a good idea? What the hell? <laughs> There's a code at the top that tells you my secret registration code in your purse, right? Sometimes you got that sweet tooth and then you're just gonna be like four, four, <laughs> like a bank robber. <laughs> I feel like this is for grandma and grandpa. Mm -mm. 
That can't be right. I was gonna say, grandma and grandpa, they need to lock up their meds, but no, they don't. They need to easily get into their meds. I wonder if they gave everybody the same damn code. If you have one of these, let me know if your code is 9115, because that's my code. And if they gave everybody the same damn code, we're just gonna rename this just a regular bottle because then everybody's gonna know the code and then kids can Google it on the internet and boom, they're in. One, five. This is kind of dumb and it was expensive. It was 15 bucks, let's see. Oh, uh, it doesn't open. See, here's the problem. If you have diabetes and you need your medication or you have a heart condition fiddling around with this thing, you might faint. You might if you can't get it open and there's an emergency because you forgot to take it at three and it's already seven at night. Has that ever happened to you? Are you supposed to do this? kind of, <laughs> I don't know, reset it or something? Is there some kind of resetting technology? Can we reboot? <laughs> Is there a reboot button? Let me power it back up because that shit ain't working. Maybe I'm doing it wrong. Maybe I have to do 5119. That's backwards. <laughs> In America, <laughs> we read left to right, not right. To left. My idea of doing this the other way is dumb, but I'm gonna try it because it doesn't work. Uh, Safe RX, y'all owe me $15. Go ahead and send me that check. Send it over with a courier, Uber Eats. <laughs> send me a snack. You're causing me to drink. <laughs> I'm gonna give the safety locking bottle zero. Vivian heads. Now my final thoughts on this guy is genius. Get one for yourself, one for your sister, one for your sister-in-law. And don't forget cute.com after this video is over, go shop. We are dropping five colors of this beautiful side tie hoodie. Good luck getting one because they sell out immediately. So try to get you one because I love the colors. I'll see you on the website at 6 p.m. Central Standard Time. So I'm gonna give this guy five. Vivian heads. And I'll see you guys in the next one.